What's up guys, FIFA Point by here bringing you yet another play review. Today I'm going to review in the 90 Prime Inzaghi. Inzaghi is 5 foot 11, has medium low work rates, has 3 star weak foot and 3 star skill move. These are his in-game stats, his key stats being his attack positioning, his finishing, his reactions and his heading accuracy. Inzaghi is one of the most lethal finishers that I've used on this game. If he gets a chance in the box, it's almost guaranteed that it'll end up in the back of the net. If you buy Inzaghi expecting him to be a world beater, you're going to end up seriously disappointed. Inzaghi isn't the sort of player to dribble past two to three men and score, but he's simply a perfect target man that'll always provide you goals when you need them. Inzaghi isn't the quickest, nor is he the strongest, but he makes up with his positioning and amazing attacking awareness. If you use Inzaghi the way he's intended to be used, which is an out and out poacher and target man, you'll honestly love this card as he's honestly one of the best finishers that I've used this year. But if you're expecting the world from him and you want a striker that will dribble past two to three men and score amazing goals, you're looking at the wrong player. I'll be back at the end for a quick summary and I hope you enjoy the rest of the highlights. I just wanted to point out at this stage of the video, if you choose to play at this stadium, you honestly have issues. Inzaghi's pros are his finishing, his positioning, his shot power, his long shots and his heading and his cons are his strength, his stamina, his 3 star skill moves and his 3 star weak foot. Overall I give Inzaghi an 8.5 out of 10 as if you use him as the finisher he's intended to be, he's up there with the best in the game. I'd also give him a value for coins rating as 8.5 out of 10. Inzaghi costs between 400 and 450k on both the Xbox and the Playstation. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Peace.